What's good, Homer Squad? It's your boy, Homer Ziggy. We back here with another four piece reaction for y'all. And for the poor, for the poor, <laughs> I don't know what I was saying. For the four piece, we got we got ham sandwich, we got my guy Aizen Senpai, we got freaking Kevin B. Kevin Bennett, sorry, and we got Nerd Out. So, sorry about that. You already know. I be trying to make sure I remember which I try to make sure I get them right off the head top before yeah but so we're gonna start this one off with a blue lock rap f-o-m-w and i saw the thumbnail for it so it means f out my way with ham sandwich and i literally just watched it recently literally before this and such and so far knowing it's about soccer and such and how it is affected to the world cup and such by the way shout out to argentina winning I can pretty much say it's an intense anime and it's about soccer and I play soccer so hey I can relate so we about to check this out make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on all my socials up there and without further ado let's get in the video Ooh, look out man Whoa. look out man Whoa. Whoa. a little unstable Whoa. right Whoa. now man hey, hey. look crazy Whoa. man Whoa. Whoa. Oh, hey. because I might go crazy man hey. Hey. Whoa. 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 Hop into the game and it's a free for all. You gon' have to want me, want me, you can't get your team involved. Everyone around me sitting waiting, wishing me to fall. You don't even need the ball, you should pass the rock and get the fuck out of my way, bitch. Just stay the fuck out of my way, bitch. I need my motherfucking spaces, motherfucking race, you ain't matching my pace, bitch. Hey, let me see you doing suicides on the sidelines. Let me see you doing suicide on the sidelines. Okay, suicide. If you know, that's that's another sports thing where you. So for those who aren't sports people, well, in a way they did play, but for su for those who aren't sports people, suicides are where, especially if not only in soccer but in basketball, where you run from one side to the court, all the way to the other side of it, or in this case in a soccer field, you run from one side to the other, and trust me, I've done it before. Them bitches is Let me see you doing suicides on the sideline Then if you survive, maybe you could be with my kind Put me in the fire, I'm alive and I'm thriving in the flame You a lame bitch, you gotta be insane to be the greatest Cause the mama mentality is a logical fallacy Tossing the bouncing after living off of your mastery You gotta live, breathe, the dream of supremacy Fantasize about the dairy, you can murder the enemy Give them hell until they blow the whistle Somebody get a stretcher Do a foul if I need to and then ignore the lecture Cause Cause literally, literally the only way, cause it's like this, with Blue Lock, the main goal of Isaki, Isaki and many other footballers there, is to be the best striker. And if you played soccer, you know that if you're the striker, trust me, that means, cause even though with me, I'm more, I'm the defense guy, and trust me, one thing with me on defense, nobody could, one thing, look. For people who've seen me play, they know when it comes to defense, I don't care how big you are, I don't care how strong you are. I'ma make sure that one, you don't get past me, or two, if any of you try to shoot, I'm making sure I block that shit. But all my Until they blow the whistle, Damn. somebody get a stretcher Damn. Do a foul if I need to and then ignore the lecture Cause if you bout it, he gon' understand Call it underhanded if you want, I got the upper hand Rob, we can run the hand, I ain't into politics I could be 11 down, but I ain't finna call it quiz I can see mm, cause for the, I don't wanna spay it Like, I don't wanna like spoil it for the people But if you have been watched, if you did watch the anime but if you aren't, let's just say a certain player on Isaki's team turned on them. The future in my field, I got an Oculus and offer if I guarantee I copy it. No stopping this, no stopping this. I up into the game and it's a free for all. You gon' have to want me, want me, you can't get your team involved. Everyone around me sitting waiting, wishing me to fall. You don't even need the ball, you should pass the rock and get the fuck out my way, bitch. Just bitch. Cause it's like this. Literally everybody in that anime. The like I said, the main purpose of it is to be the best striker, right? So, even though they're all a team, at the end of the day, sooner, once you watch the more of the anime, sooner or later they realize, even though they're all a team, 
But let's face it, if you play soccer, you know how like it would be so hard for to be a team of 11 when knowing all of the 11 players are strikers. So it would be hard for them to either play defense or one of them being the goalie when nine when you know damn well each of them is known for striking. It's a free for all. You gon' have to want me, want me. You can't get your team involved. Everyone around me sitting waiting, wishing me to fall. You don't even need the ball. You should pass the rock and get the fuck out my way, bitch. Just stay the fuck out my way, bitch. I need my motherfucking space in this motherfucking race. You ain't matching my pace, bitch. Hey, bitch. I'm about to pop off. Let me get a shot off. Flew right by. You think I hit it with a sawed off? I'm never gonna fall off. I'm never getting caught off. I get one touch and everybody gets. Caught off guard because literally, I fall off. I'm never getting caught off. I get one touch and everybody getting caught off guard. I got all stars with me, myself, and I have felt the fire, my soul ablaze. So I'm the best in the session, and there ain't no debate. Somebody hold my ego down before I float away. Because one of the characters, one of the characters in that anime is called Ego. So I'm the best in the session, and there ain't And let's face it, in sports, let's face it, no matter which sports you play. Everybody got an ego. I, even if you're one of the best, you all we all know there's a you gotta have come on, you really think that most players, whether it's soccer, football, basketball, cricket, tennis, whatever, right? You really think that nine times out of ten you don't think they got a little e you don't think they have a little ego in them saying that yeah, I'm the best. You don't think they got a little ego in them? Come on now. It would be impossible, it would be wrong of you to say you don't have one. Ain't no debate, somebody. Cause shit, I know, cause it's like this. Like I said, with me, I ju you just heard me. If anyhow I'm on defense and you're in my eyesight, I'm making sure your ass do not pass me. And if any of you try to make a shot, I'm making guarantee sure whether I have to slide tackle your ass or freaking foul you. You ain't taking a shot. Hold my ego down before I float away. Hey. I've been in the game and it's a free for all. You gon' have to want me, want me. You can't get your team involved. Everyone around me sitting waiting, wishing me to fall. You don't even need the ball. You should pass the rock and get the fuck out my way, bitch. Just stay the fuck out my way, bitch. I need my motherfucking space in this motherfucking race. You ain't matching my pace, bitch. Hey. Shout out to the loop, man. And, and now for my guy Aizen Senpai featuring Delta D's Anything for you Chainsaw Man I never thought I'd be someone like you I might sound crazy but I can't believe that it's true You play in my head on repeat Yeah, yeah, let me lay <laughs> And I gotta say you collabing with Delta, knowing how this nigga could go and Yeah, and the thing is, I figure with Delta, yeah, them two are definitely gonna be the going into the singing. Right? You play in my head on repeat, yeah, yeah, let me lay at your feet, yeah, yeah, baby, take control of me, I'll do as you please, as long as you don't take your This nigga said, if he's gonna have, like, he will start kissing any other girls and such, cause even though his first kiss was with him, him Meno, even though it was a disgusting one. <laughs> but, with, thanks to Maki, anytime when now he's gonna think of kisses, she gave him like a little lollipop or so, so that way he knows that kisses taste is like that. But if any, but he said, and I quote, if anyhow he's gonna get this first time mm -mm, with a girl, it's gotta be Miss. Yeah, you play in my head on repeat. Yeah. Yeah. I 
seen how Miss Makima is in Chainsaw Man trust me the power she got I mean this is how powerful she is she in the anime her power her yeah, yes. sorry that was my dad but yeah like I was saying in the anime her power is so big and such that if anyhow she's gonna want to do it and there's other people involved other devil hunters or many other people but mostly other devil hunters are not allowed to see it so she would literally have them blindfold so anyhow when she do doing it nobody else could see her power and trust me, we see how her power is. The fact is when she's like, bro, all I gotta say is watch the anime and you t and trust me, you see why everybody is in a way friendly with Miss Makima, but in the meantime, scared of her. You don't take your love from me. And it's so crazy to think that, Aizen, I know you said before that you just like to do your own thing, but I'm just saying, my bro, if you were in a, if you're in a, if you were ever gonna be in a nerdcore, collect, like a collective, I'm telling you, Otaku Underwear would definitely be a fit for you, because I mean, you directed one of their videos, you directed Slick's Teddy video back in September so and plus he was hanging out with them in Saint Japan so I'm just saying my bro if anyhow when you decide to want to join a collective if I know you say you don't want to but if somehow in the near future when you do I'm telling you Otaku Underworld is the best can throw the road, get the order and, and I take it I ain't thinking, 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 thinking I just move Chainsaw blades room, hey Slays all day face If she say so, I'll do Anything for you I never thought I'd need Someone like And then these two coming together to sing the hook Yeah, what I tell you The fact that you got Aizen and Delta Knowing those two Nerco artists known for their good singing Trust me It's a, it's definitely a rapid, rapid a recipe I'm trying to say for a great sick for a great I never thought I need someone like you something like this and such right giving you a sensation when she's biting your thumb not too hard but just the right moment to turn you on 
What can I say? If a girl bites my finger that much, if a girl is gonna bite my thumb, and it's that sexual, not too hard, but just in a way it makes me <laughs> and such. Let's just say. <laughs> She points me, I'm sorry, but if anyhow she points me to go in, rev up the chainsaw, say, baby, who you want me to kill? And she points out to you. <clears throat> Don't take it personal, just baby, like, oh, take control of me. Shout out to Aizen, man. Shout out to Delta, Otaku Underworld. Y'all already know I rock with y'all heavy. But I'm just saying, Aizen, in the near future, if anyhow you do decide to want to join a collective in Nerdcore, I'm just saying, Otaku Underworld, it, it fits your type of energy. Because you know how they expect. Because they could go... Because, one... You know, you can do drill music, that's for sure. What you doing the I Don't Need Friends one? Just because I can get money with. Because that's the first time I've ever heard you on a drill type beat like that. Even if it's slow and such, the way how you handle that one, fire. And where you can get saucy with it with your flashy one. Bro, still to this day, right, Aizen? I know this is going to be a long one, so we're going to go into the next one. But I just want to say, Aizen, hold on. Still to this day. No matter which song, no matter what songs you keep on releasing, still to this day, the first time I'm ever gonna remember you for, from the moment I remember you, was your dang Tengen Uzi song with Flashy. Flashy, you say you know me. Like, bro, I'm sorry. I don't care if it's gonna be a year old to me, two years old, nigga. That song is fire. And the fact that because of that song, I feel like because of that song where you got now with, now you was on a song with Rustage, and that's on, and that song with you and Rustage is up to a, is a, a million plus now, million views, trust me, but like I said, just to end it off bro, if anyhow in the near future when you do want to go on a Nerdcore collab, if you want to join a Nerdcore collab, Octaku Underworld is the right place for you, but Regardless, shout out to you, my boy. But now we on to another Chainsaw Man rap, but this time with B. Kevin Betty. Cut him off. We got an intent now, Mr. Wrestler. Mr. World Champion of Nerdcore. I had to sever my ties with devilish minds. And ever since I did that, I feel so light. Wanna cut you out my life, it was good for my mind. Cause if I find me some day, Wait, it's gonna be sliced Cut them off Cut them Cut them off Cut them off Cut them off Cut them off Cut them Cut them off Cut them off I don't live a normal life, I never did Everybody would be horrified With my story and forced to be tortured by the unfortunate course So I'm borderline not in my Already playing with them syllables and the rhyme scheme Hold on Nah, hold on. I'm gonna do. Look, I'm gonna pull a school phrase John type of reaction where we're gonna hear these songs. Alright, let's go. I don't live a normal life. I never did. Right. Everybody would be horrified. Fine. Everybody would be horrified. And watch how it's gonna continue from. But my story right. forced to be. No. Screw that. It wasn't from there. It was right here now. Where I'm forced. I'm forced to be torn about. But listen to the way how he just make it be so. Sports by the unfortunate course, so I'm borderline not in my right mind with a morbid side. More than likely because the endorphin high. My power ranges when it's morphin time. Get my power rangers when it's morphin time. Mighty morph the power rangers. 
Go, go, Power Rangers, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, fuck is you talking about? I'm in my right mind with a morbid side, more than likely because the endorphin high. My power ranges when it's morphin time, get torn the fuck up, Demogorgon style. Everybody's so toxic, with a waste of a time, get a hazmat suit with a gas mask too, give me oxygen. Refusing to breathe in the fumes, I'll be getting so fumed, removed to the garbage bin. Hazard the shit, it's best to stay far from it, it's hard to get away from darkness. I'll be getting so few and removed to the garbage yeah. bin. Hazard the shit is best to. It's best to. A best. It's best to. A best to. Stay stay far from it. It's hard to get away from darkness when it's around your whole life and starts as a kid. So I'll take it upon myself. Gonna withdraw the sword like I'm a carpenter. Cut an arm off. I'll contact the dog for gossip. Prosthetic with lots of blood loss. But y'all can turn deadly. 911. Somebody call up a medic. You better step on the gas. I'm revving up with the engine. Rev it. Me and that shit living separate. Go get split like an edit. Yeah. yeah. Go get. Go get split like an edit. Oh no, nah. Be Kevin Benny. You just rest. Like I said, you a wrestler, so you just rest. I'ma call you Mr. Wrestler with Nerdcore. The wrestler of Nerdcore. Cause goddamn it, he's just wrestling with these words. Contact the dog for gods and prosthetic, but lots of blood loss, but y'all can turn deadly. 911, somebody call up a medic. You better step on the gas. I'm revving up with the engine. Rev it. Me and that shit living separate. Go get split like an edit. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Too many demons that trying to feed on my energy It's been too long that I let them in And they always seem to get the best of me But nowadays my mind is sharp And I'm not afraid to be head of fiend I started up then I shred and leave I had to sever my ties With devilish my Look I swear For those who think the Kevin Benny can't freaking Whoop your ass not only in a ring But with these bars I'm telling you, if there was ever a if there was ever a championship in Nerdcore, B. Kevin Bennett is winning it. I'm sorry, DPS. You may be a big, strong guy and such, but let's face it, you are a bodybuilder. You're not a wrestler. Started up. You only played basketball. You didn't play wrestling. You didn't. Then I shred and leave. I had to sever my ties with devilish minds, and ever since I did that, I feel so light. Wanna cut you out, my. I'm surprised. I'm surprised DPS don't collab with the Kevin Bennett. Did he? Nah, he didn't. Life, it was good for my mind. Cause if I find yeah, me bro. some dead weight, it's gonna be sliced. Cut him off. I cut him. Cut him off. Cut him off. Cut him off. Cut him off. Demons, I put a dagger through him easy, drag him through the dirt and put him through the ringer. Bitch, I'm Michael Myers, stabbing you repeated, stabbing on a heathen vision, going pitch black while I get to packing on the lesions. I don't just attack without a valid reason. I'm a lumberjack, I'm hacking for the season. Get off my sack, I'm a sack. I'm hacking for, I'm just a lumberjack, I'm hacking for the season. And to be honest, with Deji, like he said, he had for no reason. I mean, he just has a, he has a reason. Whether you're a demon, he don't, it's like this, with Deji, he don't care if you're a good guy or a bad guy. All he knows is if you fuck with him, he gonna start ying ying Put him through the ringer, bitch, I'm Michael Myers, stabbing you repeated, stabbing uh, on a heathen vision, uh, going pitch black while I get to packing on the lesions. I don't just attack without a valid reason, I'm a lumberjack, I'm hacking for the season. Get off my sack, I'm a psychopath, and slice and dice a track right after that, acting like nothing happened, I just attach him like Sandra Lee, taking him off my back, chains off a hand to hold mass, to the grown man into a half, I'm doing a half ass, I'm looking to move past. Turn a grown man into a half ass, I'm doing a half ass. The freaking word play up, the freaking word play, the word flip up. Get him off my back, chains off a hand to hold massacre to the grown man. Look here, turn, a whole massacre, turn a grown man into Man, do a half, I'm doing a half. I'm doing it half ass. Half ass, I'm looking to move past. Don't forget all your roots, I'm going to landscape the grass. Yeah, 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 yeah. Amputating half a leg, do it with a happy face. I'm going off in a classic way with no mask of pain. When I gash with a massive blade, I don't fabricate the way that I'm going to act today. And don't face me, I have to change. See, with D. Kevin Bennett, I feel like with him, I feel like this is how he got that type of logic type flow. And I get it, like, I know logic, in a way, if you see how logic raps and you hear how B and putting D. Kevin Bennett together, in a way, it kind of matches, but D. Kevin Bennett has a different style of how he does his.
with Logic, you can guarantee that you can tell when it's a Logic song or so. But with E. Kevin Bennett, not saying that he's not, but I'm just saying with E. Kevin Bennett, he just has like a different way of how he does his type of rap styles and stuff. Mask pain when I gas with a master blade. I don't fabricate the way that I'm going to act today. You don't face me, I have to chase him like Jason. They be dancing in the And hold on. And I also got to say, because trust me, with... Because back to the whole Logic thing, with Logic, you would definitely know when it's a Logic song. Whether he's talking about he being biracial. Or when he starts doing the same old, using the same old lyrics. I don't know. But it's like this. Either way, at the end of the day, they both have these different styles of rapping that in a way I kind of like. Where it's not too much fast rapping. It's bars in there. And they telling a story throughout it in a way, not like storytelling wise, but just speaking on some realish, just speaking out, talking pure ignorance in a way, and telling you what's up. Straight don't up. fabricate the way that I'm gonna act today. You don't face me, I have to chase them like Jason. They be dancing the Mac and brain every time that I slash the brain. Hey, trim the fat to take weight up off of my shoulders. So many monsters, you would think it's the end of October. I cut them down, they keep coming back, I guess I should find a new mower But that's okay, it's not over I had to sever my ties with devilish minds And ever since I did that, I feel so light Wanna cut you out my life, it was good for my mind Cause if I find me some dead weight, it's gonna be sliced Cut them off, I cut them Cut them off, cut them off Cut them off, cut them off I cut them Cut him off, cut him off. 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 We gon' cut him, cut him off, cut him off. In the I can't rap for shit. I just repeating it back. But hey, shout out to the Kevin Bennett, man. But now to end off this four-piece reaction, we got the Legends of Korra song, Let the Wind Show the Way, with Nerd Out, featuring Juliet, Juliet Riley, really? Sorry if I butcher your name wrong, and yes, this is another, this is day 10, if I'm not mistaken now, day 10 of the 12 days of Nerd Out. What would be the point? Well, it is what it is, but either way. Oh, snap! When I fall asleep, I see it in my dreams, the master of it all. Blend into the crowd But I can't wait to stand out And answer to the call But everything is changing The winds that I've been chasing Got me suffocating To live up to the name But what did I get into? I and even though I used to watch this when I was younger But I gotta say I had to say this Legend of Quora even though I can tell, like, I guess you can say it's a, it's like a, you can say a spin-off or so to Avatar. But you can tell where it kind of meets in the same. They kind of connect to each other, but tells two different stories in it. Can't seem to break through, playing by the old rules, but you change the game. So much I can prove And I don't wanna lose All the songs have been sung But I don't hear a sound All the noise is the same Why? And why I feel like I can hear like Like if you remember when they played I mean played Did a Tough song last year or so with hot with another lady rapper 
a lady Nerco artist called Hallo Seenin. Not Hallo Seegio. Not Hallo Seegio. I was about to say Hallo Seenin. It sounds a way like that. What was that Hallo CG before she did? Broken from my past, falling from my path, a poison deep within. But what if it all breaks down? Struggling for air now, need to find a way out, fighting through the pain. But what did I get into? I can't seem to break through, playing by the old rules. But you changed the game. There's so much I can. There's so much I can prove And I don't wanna lose All the songs have been sung But I don't hear a sound All the noise is the same All the air in my life I'm not gonna lie to you, it's been a long time since I've seen like Avatar or The Legends of Korra Cause like I said before, I've seen it's like some of the OG cartoons that I use, or I would say this, because even though this is like anime or so, but it's not, I don't know. Y'all correct me if these are called anime, this, if you can classify like Legends of Korra and Avatar as anime. To me, I didn't, but either way, right, these are like the OGs when it comes to cartoon or so, right, for me, so... But like I'm saying, it's been a long time I want to watch them, and what can I say? It's like this, right? Throughout most of these nerdcore songs, and especially when they were doing the ones that I watched when I was a kid, like Free Soul, who did like a Kim Possible one, or the, if you remember when Vanish so, Vanquish So Real did a Teen Titans Cypher one and such, them are the ones that I would want to watch when I was younger and when I would want to watch Black Soul and such and when I mean the Teen Titans one I mean like the original one not the Teen Titans Go one them are some of the ones that I want to watch back again cause shit them were like the OG's when it came to cartoons oh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching today's music video for The Legend of Korra featuring the amazing vocals of Juliet Riley. We'd also like to thank right. today's sponsor, the tw yeah, yeah, 2022 yeah, know, yeah, Game of the it. Year winner, Marvel Snap. Now me personally, I've been playing this free to play card collection game for a Yeah, 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 we already know y'all. Look, with all due respect to Nerd Out, shout out to y'all for the sponsors and all, but let's face it, you know damn well, y'all ain't gonna do all that on my channel but hey shout out to everybody on this four piece man from like ham from eisen from kevin and nerd out and such y'all did y'all thing y'all came with some energy all right some with some f some crazy energy These are just like four piece reaction. These are just like the four levels of fire I like. Where it has litness, it has emotion, it has rap, it just has bars, 
and it has some smoothness in it so i might as well just call these the four levels of fire because <laughs> you know damn well in the thumbnail i might do something like that but hey shout out to everybody who is on this four piece reaction y'all y'all let me know which one of them you liked and such and let me know in the comments below what you thought about this reaction man and hey we almost to a close of 2022 i just want to say shout out to everybody who's been subscribing to my channel man we're almost there even though i don't think we'll be able to hit that 1k by the end of this year and such but hey either way shout out to y'all for making me be close to it and such but either way let me know what y'all thought about this in the comments below it's been your boy homo ziggy signing out stay positive and keep the vibes up lego